So you want to do something like this, right? Where you can change the intensity of, let's say, your bloom or change the tint of your um, white balance or maybe toggle some overrides on and off or another example being changing the RGB values in your color mixer or maybe you just want to have more control over your um, post-processing at runtime. So let's use Bloom as an example here. So let's open up Visual Studio. All right, using Unity Engine dot rendering. Let me copy paste that. And write Unity Engine dot rendering dot universal under that. So now let's. Uh, create our reference for the volume. So serialized field, private volume. And let's call that volume. So now let's create our uh, float that controls the intensity. So private float, serialized field that, uh, intensity. And let's also cache our bloom here. And let's call that bloom. So private bloom bloom. And let's create our update function. And now let's write um, volume dot profile dot try get out bloom. Don't forget the semicolon there as well. Uh, so this basically grabs the bloom from the volume if it has one. So bloom dot intensity dot value should be equal to intensity, the float we made. And oh yeah, I forgot the semicolon up here. Um, so let's create a serialized field private bool now. And let's call that uh, toggle bloom. And let's write the try get Let's write bloom dot active is equal to toggle bloom. Just a quick heads up here, uh, constantly changing the values, especially if it's more than, uh, it can be very performance heavy. So you might want to put it in an on value changed function instead. Uh, so now we can add our global volume to the volume slot in our controller script. And let's hit play toggle bloom and yeah now we can see that uh, the blooms working and we can change the intensity of it so here's a quick tip for you if you don't know the property names or the names of the values you can just uh, right click and then copy property path and then you can just uh, paste that into your code be sure to replace m underscore value with value.